Hi friends! Today I'm going to show you guys how to do a self-portrait. Um, yesterday in her video, Kara talked about Frida Kahlo. I got a little candle here with her face. Do you guys remember Frida? Frida was a Mexican artist and she was really famous. And one of the things that she was famous for was um, were her self-portraits. What is a self-portrait? So a self-portrait is a picture that the artist makes of themselves. And it can be a picture, it can be a painting, you can use crayons, colors, markers, anything you want. Today we're gonna learn how to make one. I have a little mirror in my station because I think it's important that you look at yourself. Uh, it might, I think it makes it easier, but you can choose if you want to do it in front of a mirror or not. And I'm gonna start with a pencil because I'm gonna start drawing the outline first. So the first thing we're gonna look at is what shape is your face? I think my face kind of looks like a U. So I'm gonna make a U first. I think that's the easiest way to do it. So I'm gonna make a U. And then I'm gonna do my neck. You guys see it? After I do my neck, I'm gonna choose what clothes I'm wearing. This time I think I might choose, I'm wearing a different kind of shirt. Or maybe I'm wearing a dress. I'm just going to do the top of the shirt part. Then I'm going to do my eyes. I'm gonna do the shape of my eyes and then I'll worry about the details later. Right now, I'm just gonna do the shape. I'm going to use watercolors, but you guys can choose anything you want. You can choose markers or crayons or whatever materials you choose. Right now, I'm gonna use my watercolors. So right here, I have my, um, my little palette with some of the colors that I, I think I'm gonna use. And if I need more, I'll just get them as I go. So first I'm gonna color the skin part and the, it's gonna be the face and it's going to be the neck. So I'm gonna get started with that part first and I'll show you guys how it's looking. Maybe some, maybe you guys can see a little bit. So I'm gonna start with all of the skin part. You guys get to choose what color your skin is gonna be. I'm choosing, mine is a lighter pink and I mix some red and some white to make this color. And I think I, it turned out pretty, pretty well. So I'm going to start with the skin and the face. Frida was in a bus accident. Do you guys remember Kara? Kara talked about that yesterday. She was in a bus accident and she hurt her spine really bad when she was young. So many years of her life, she didn't feel very good. And she had to spend lots of time at home and she would use her paintings to imagine she was in different places and to create all these memories, even though she couldn't leave her house for a while. So I did the skin. And next I'm going to do the hair. I think my hair is dark brown. So I made a mix of some dark brown and I'm going to get started with writing that. I like starting on the top and then deciding how long I'm going to go. And then I'm gonna do the other side as well. And remember, art is not perfect and that's okay. You guys get to decide what's wrong and what's right in your paintings. It can be whatever you guys want it to be. You guys can even picture a different background. Maybe your self-portrait is in a, in a beach somewhere or maybe you're in Glacier Park, maybe you are in a magical land full of colors. You guys can decide wherever you are. Okay, so I did my hair. And now I'm going to work on my nose. Since I have the brown, I'm gonna use the brown to make the shape of what I think my nose would look like. So I'm gonna do it just like that. Now, I am going to use a thinner uh, brush and I'm going to work on the eyes. I'm going to put some eyelashes in the inside of my eyes. So, I'm going to work on the eyelashes first. And then, I'm going to work on the inside of the eyes. Let's see. Can you guys look in your mirror and see what color your eyes are? Mine are dark brown. So, I'm going to get again my dark brown and I can make the inside of my eyes dark brown. I like leaving a tiny bit of white inside of them. There we go. Now I'm going to grab a tiny bit of red 
and I'm going to work on the outline of the lips. And you guys can make your lips any color you want, or maybe you're, you, Frida used to use her paintings to talk about her emotions. So if you're happy, maybe you're making a big smile. Maybe you're feeling sad. Maybe you're feeling something else. And you can choose what your smile or your mouth is saying, what emotion your mouth is saying. So right now I made my mouth. Um, and I'm going to finish up with the eyes and then I'm going to choose this time. I'm not going to color my shirt, but that's what my self portrait is going to look like. I made another one earlier today and it looks just like this. And you guys can choose what yours looks like. I would really like to see what you guys have made. So please post them on our Facebook page. I really want to see all of your self portraits. And remember, there's no wrong in art. Your art can look whatever you guys like, and it's okay, and it's going to be beautiful, and it's going to be amazing, and I can't wait to see it. Bye, you guys.